Pina, what are you doing? He is definitely acting like a cat. I always make jokes that he doesn't know he's a squirrel because he is so cuddly and affectionate. Hey, good boy. What are you doing? Can I have that? Excuse me, peanut. Give me that avocado. Everything that I do in my house, I just do with a squirrel on my shoulder. Clean up, watching TV, breakfast. I had to be very patient with him. We have to do this every morning. But Peanut changed my personal life. <laughs> I work as a building inspector. I was leaving work one day. I saw the squirrel get hit by a car. And as I got closer, I noticed a little baby. And the little baby was Peanut. And instead of him running away, he actually just crawled up my leg. Vets in this area we just wanted to put him down. So I took him home and uh, I nursed him back to health. I wanted him to be a wild squirrel, so I did re-release him back outside. But he only spent a day outside before he got attacked. I found him sitting on my porch, missing half of his tail. Excuse me, Mr. Grumpy. I thought I got him prepped well enough for the outdoors. But unfortunately, he just never developed the wildlife instinct. Ever since then, we have just become inseparable. When I get home, he actually like wags his tail. Um, his personal tree, his chauffeur. I do every household thing with Peanut. I will brush my teeth with him on my shoulder. Our bond is very, very strong, but he's the king of the house. He'll walk around the house like he owns it. It's funny to watch him use the litter box. I can't believe he does it. He loves to jump on me when I open the refrigerator because he knows all of his treats are in there. Over time, I realized that he really likes waffles. So we kind of just started making breakfast with Mark and Peanut. Did big cookies and stuff. I love being in the kitchen and cooking. So it kind of just worked out perfectly. My friends and family don't even ask about me anymore. It's all about Peanut. If somebody finds my phone, it's either engineering work or a squirrel. <laughs> It's just like that love connection where he's your family member. It's always love, it's always caring. And that's something that I will cherish forever.